We're here in Lelystad, Holland, uh, at the Holland Composites facility. We are building a 46-foot falling cat, similar size to what you see in the America's Cup, but focused at uh, offshore capabilities to sail from New York to Bermuda. Hey guys, oh, come in, come in. Cool, man. Come in. So offshore is the unknown. Basically, you're going out and you don't know, you know, how the weather can change, the sea state, you know, breakdowns. There is no help, you know, in case things go wrong. So you have to really trust the people around you and the equipment you're using. The most unique thing is a foiling catamaran. The foils are not only lifting the boat, but also stabilizing the boat. So it's a very smooth and fast ride. If the platform isn't correct, isn't safe, isn't fast, isn't well engineered, the future of the plan is flawed. And so this is the foundation of the whole project, the centerpiece for the mission itself. There's no material, let's say, stiffer, stronger, lighter than carbon fiber epoxy. The carbon fiber is basically layers, thin layers of fabrics. You have to apply these layers into a mold, into a shape, and then you have to press it in the shape and cure it. That's basically the process. Yeah. You go this way, so you can pull the car. Wait for a moment. Good. This is the first time we've actually stepped foot on the boat. The goal of the day is to check ergonomics, heights, distances between different parts of the boat. The guy's first impression? Really good. There are all the small details that can still vary in the, in the process. These are the things that actually make the boat so much better in reality for the sailors that will be sailing this boat offshore. This is the best. This is the best. Now, to solve this... Like a racing car, the, the driver always yeah, gives information to, let's say, the constructors or the designers to make it even better. And that works the same like here. What you're seeing right now is the F4 being released from the main mold. Uh, which is quite a big moment for us. It allows us to inspect the bottom side of the boat, the quality of the laminate, and then we can let the painters get to work. To see it go from thought to screen, you know, to physical aspect is a, is a really cool thing. When it leaves here, we will be confident that it leaves the way it should. This is the first offshore foiling catamaran in the world. The F4 will be heading to the US today. We had to go to Baltimore to rendezvous with a boat that was arriving from Europe. You can notice the hull shape and the form of it, and it was just there on the top deck. That was a really cool feeling. Like I even get goosebumps thinking about it right now. And it was now up to us to bring it safely back north to Newport. That in itself was a pretty pretty cool feat to tow it foiling for that amount of distance in open ocean. And then all the other components and systems, hydraulics, the sails, you know, put the wrap on and do all the kind of things that go together to do a mission like this. So that all happened in a very compressed timeline of two weeks. It was a big team effort to get to where we are today. Yeah.